Hello, welcome to our channel. I'm Brett, here with my wife Nicole, and our four lovely children, Maverick, Maxton, Malachi, and Michaelin. We love going out in the outdoors and camping and having a great time. Here's our converted schoolie bus. Here's our travel trailer. Here's our pop-up camper. And sometimes we even get cabins. We really enjoy going to the mountains, especially going out to Case Cove, where his pictures come from. Get out on the water and do some fishing from time to time. Love camping. Please like and subscribe. Thank you very much. Today, guys, we're going to Baker's Creek State Park, a few miles from Georgia on 378, South Carolina. State Park's in. Let's go check it all out. All right, so you come down a few miles, and then you see the entrance to the state park. You keep going that way, some more that way, some more private roads and stuff down that way. But anyway, make a left into Burgess Creek State Park. Just note they got a new sign here. They used to have shrubs and all around this. They cleaned it up, and they all look different. So the gate, at the gate right here. They normally keep the gate closed. This is a seasonal park still. Don't see many of them anymore. But it is a seasonal park. I want to say it's October to April, I think. It's October to April. Pretty sure that's right. April, April, October. It's April, April, October is what it is. Come through here and paid a little Iron Ranger. Luckily, we've already paid. We've been in here today already. You continue on in. There's our first sign here at the camping area and pavilion office on the pavilion. Like I said, it's a pretty long drive through here. Which is nice though. When you're not pulling the camper or in the, or in the camper. Just kind of just ride through like a little country drive. Boat ramp is this way. They got a nice boat ramp there too. Road is not the best, but the driveway is okay. I mean, the ramp is okay. The road is not the best. All right, parking hours here. Do have restrooms here? Often talk about coming fishing down here to go to the shore fish, but we never have. Keep forgetting about it, awesome. We always go to the front where the kids can swim, a little swimming area up there, and we fish around that area. But there's some little fish spots here, too. the cove there. Ramps, picnic tables here back. Can't swim down here too, there's no swimming within a hundred foot of boat ramp. And here at the park. Let's go check the campground out. All right, camping area this way. 
Park office and picnic area that way. Right there. We're redoing the rest of the um, trash cans. Oh, the camper came behind us. That's where the trash cans were at once upon a time. This was all treated up pretty badly. They've done a little bit of logging. We ain't got it to go since I opened up this year. It was one way in, one way out. Yeah, they've done a lot of logging. Terry's doing some logging. Yeah, I said I changed the campground host. Um, what were? Campground men. Woman. All right, here at the campground.
day use area. Used to be a big swimming pavilion all here. I've done away with that. Thank you, Councilman. Great Lord, landmine. You swim with your own <laughs> at risk across the whole campground now. Got a couple picnic tables. That's an old bath house on that side there. You can change and take a shower and whatnot. And done away with all that. You still got swimming area down there. Swimming down, swimming down matter of fact. And then playground, a couple covered picnic sheds. And restrooms out here. And restrooms up here at the shed. The shed where the office is actually a cookout shed too that you can rent. It's covered. Mm -hmm. There's plenty of parking. Well, I think that does it for Bucket Creek.